హలో యువ పద ఎక్స్పర్ట్స్ వెల్కమ్ టు ద యువ పద లర్నర్ ఛానల్ థ్యాంక్ యూ వెరీ మచ్ ఫర్ సబ్స్క్రైబ్ యువ పద లర్నర్ ఛానల్ టుడే విల్ సీస్ ఎ స్మాల్ ఫ్యూ ఇంటర్వ్యూ క్వశ్చన్స్ సోడసి సో వన్ ఇంటర్వ్యూ క్వశ్చన్ ఇస్ లైక్ ఏ బేసికలీ ద డిఫరెన్స్ బిట్వీన్ ద త్రో అండ్ రీత్రో ఓకే సో వాట్ ఈస్ ద డిఫరెన్స్ బిట్వీన్ ద త్రో అండ్ రీత్రో ఇన్ ద ఎక్సెప్షన్ హ్యాండ్లింగ్ సో basically the throw throw is like a uh, if you just use a throw activity so when we use throw activity uh whenever we need to send any exceptions whenever you need to raise a business exceptions if you have a business rules suppose this this level is a uh, should not be a below this one or something like that something uh, like a suppose for example one exception i saw uh, one of the projects so it's like a you should the board should read the emails but the email should contains at least two attachments if the uh, two attachments is not there then you have to throw the exception so this is like a business has a each business has a, their own rules got it so this is like a uh, you you using a throw activity to throw the business rule exceptions uh, in in the try blocks right or is catch blocks so the uh, in, in the catch blocks if you, within the catch block if you want to rethrow rethrow in the sense you are not handling the exception in this catch block you want to send this to the parent catch or pay, just rethrow rethrow you are not handling this one uh, this is like a critical just it's, you can just use the if condition within that uh, if this is a case then rethrow this activity rethrow this exception to the parent block so parent block in the sense if the parent block does not handle by any uh, try and catch any exception handling is not there then it will it will go to the abandon um, it will just stop the process okay if you if you just have any exception handling for the parent also then what it will do it will just uh, go to the parent catch block okay the two things throw retro throw is used to throw the exceptions which is a business rule exceptions retro is used to retro suppose if you don't want to handle the exception in the child block you want to retro to the parent block suppose for example you just see as an a main dot xaml is there within that main xaml you are just handling the exception try and catch is there within the try you just call some xaml some other xaml invoking some other xaml like a process dot xaml right in the process dot xaml you already handle the any other exception handling using the try and catch so within that process dot xaml in the catch block if you don't want to handle that exception there you want to throw back to the th- throw to the top level top level parent then you can just simply use the drag and drop the retro activity into the catch block so what it will do it will retro the whatever the exception is coming here it will retro to the parent if very what is a parent here in the main dot xaml is a parent okay so that is the difference between the retro and throw just you can see here uh pm and cm okay prime minister and chief minister chief minister has the capability to do su- such kind of things suppose for example you, you have a some um, requirement in the state that is a budget is a beyond the state limits then what we have to do the cm will uh, send those requests to the pm prime minister right it's central state to central that is a, like a, so if you, if it is a limited to the threshold limit the budget is a, a, a below below that uh, limit then he can take care of that requirement got it so that is a retro to the parent that is like a throw and retro throw is used this is a simple thing throw is used to throw the business exceptions and retro is used to uh, send the retro to the parent thank you very much for watching uh, my video please subscribe